Hello, you are on Useless News! My name is Sydney. And my name is Andrew. We're going to be telling you the useless news. As you see, it's a wonderful day outside, but nobody's going out. Except us! As you can see, the weather is wonderful outside, but no one is not jumping on trampolines or something. There is the only a dog over there playing, but only it. Nobody else. As you see, no people. Only dogs. See, people are watching the friendly dinosaur. I don't get how this movie's popular. It's just a little dinosaur with a little boy named Friendly something. something. We don't know. Yes, we're not interested in movies. So. As you see, they're running around. It's popular. I don't know. The friend knows go our citizen, our friendly citizen. He's up there at Peeps Park, so he's about to tell us what the problem is. Because the problem is that 80.2 billion kids watch the friendly dinosaur, and that is really bad. Because, I mean, their brain gets, like, a lot of energy, and, and they can't sleep. I mean, every kid, almost every kid... 50% of kids on Earth can't sleep after that movie. I even heard some parents can't sleep after that movie because their kids force them to watch it with them. Well, Trafim Nosco here will tell us about the situation, about the good dinosaurs. Yes, good dinosaurs. so, um, like, it's tempting kids to watch the dinosaur movie because it's just brand new. Like, a lot of parents asked, uh, went to the studio and said, can you please delete that movie? Because every kid on Earth, 50% of kids on Earth, uh, said, uh, tempts their parents to watch that movie and buy it. It costs like $40 or so, yeah? Yeah, because of its popularity. But the boss of the... Uh, and the movie. Good dinosaur company thought it's okay because that means he'll get more money every day. So he decided to not delete it, which and is then really bad. Police called me and then they said we're going to put him in jail. But then he just ran off. Just ran off. I mean, yeah, I'm talking about that. He just ran off. Oh, people don't know where he is right now. He lived in Nashville, Tennessee. But then he, he probably ran off to India or so. I mean, I don't know. There it is, our our interview reporter, Trefen Nosko. He's going to tell us about the problem. I'm in the studio. I'm Trefen. And I want to say that because of this movie, The Friendly Dinosaur, no one eats vegetables. Or play soccer. People are getting really dumb after the movie. It's better to watch different movies like these, except nothing but the good dinosaur. Please, fall out of this news report and listen to it. You will be in grave danger like in the, that picture of that guy if you watch the good dinosaur.